everyone, welcome back to another episode of Fatal Frames. We are going into the fifth drop now, where we are going to find the Veiled House, which is terrifying. Hopefully my camera works all the way through this episode, because if not, that's gonna suck. It's already starting to glitch, but I guess we'll see. I updated my computer and everything, and I hope it works okay. Anyways, from the writings he found at Ichiru, Ichiru Manor, Ren learns of folk of a folklorist who lived on Mount Hikami. Ren sets out to the unfathomable forest to see if the rumors of a disappearing house are true. Let's do it. I'm spooked already. The Veiled House. Yep. In the course of their investigation, Ren and Rui learn of Keiji Watarai, a folklorist who settled on Mount Hikami. His writings are certain to be a treasure trove of information about the mountain and its peculiar folklore. Ren and Rui happen across a videotape that may just indicate the way to Watarai's residence. Yes, yes they did. My screen is dusty. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> There's just like sunlight coming through on it and it's like making the dust really stick out. Fuyuhi took her own life, and Rui attempted suicide. The ghosts of a shrine maiden appeared on both occasions. Yuri spoke of a black box that she found Haruka trapped in. Does the key to all these events lie in the mountain's dark past? A folklorist, Keiji Watarai, used to live there. His notes may shed some light on this mystery. The videotape Rui found on his desk- or sorry, on the desk. It seems to be related to that folklorist. I should take a look at it. Where is it? Is that it? Is that it? Because I don't want to look at it just yet. What else is around? What else is, uh, nearby? What am I... Pick up. Wait. Pick up what? What is that? These look like notes of Rui. Maybe she dropped them. I wonder if it's okay to read this. Probably not. Mr. Hojo often cries out in his sleep. He won't tell me much, but it seems like he has a recurring dream of, about a ceremony from his childhood. As a young boy, Mr. Hojo said he spent a summer with relatives at the base of Mount Kagi Kagiroi. Kagiroi. He mentioned playing in an old house and in a shrine on the mountain and some kind of festival he went to. Mr. Hojo doesn't talk much about his past. Sorry, doesn't talk about his past much. So what he has told me, I remember clearly. Is he dreaming of that ceremony? I went to festivals as a child, but all I remember is having a good time. Doesn't sound like the festival Mr. Hojo dreams about is any fun. He often cries, don't look at me in his sleep. He's always had a hard time with people staring at him, especially dislikes it when women look at him for too long. He won't even look at Miss Kurosawa or Miss Kozukata in the eye sometimes. He doesn't have that issue with me, though. Are the women he's dreaming about really that frightening? I don't know. I don't know. Alright, let's take this guy. A videotape and some notes on the desk. They seem related to Mount Hikami. Can I turn my volume up just a smidge? Yeah, that's fine. <clears throat> Incoming spooks, everyone. Spooky things gonna happen. My camera froze again. That douchebag. <laughs> お邪魔しまーす。中に入ってみたいと思います。人は住んでいないよう Sure. Yep, that's a box. That's a spooky, scary box. Oh, 
階段を上がってみたいと思います。Why would you be doing this alone, though? You know? 二階に着きました。How does she not notice? Or they? How do they not notice? How did they not notice that dude? And now they're gone. Oh my god. Spooky dude's gonna get ya. The way that this video is filmed is kind of reminding me of the uh, the Wii grudge game. Like the grudge game for the Wii. It's just like the way that the flashlight moves and everything. Uh huh. And and a dude. And a dude. There's a dude. Well then, it was a report written in Rui's handwriting, along with commentary on the video. The diary found at the old inn mentioned a folklorist who lived on Mount Hikami. I have found more information on him, including his name in books on the occult. The folklorist Keiji Watarai went to the mountain due to his obsession with the myster the mysteries of the sect living there. He then went missing, as mentioned in the diary and rumors about what happened to him abound. They said that he didn't just die or go missing, but rather he stumbled on something the mountain wanted kept hidden, so his entire house was swallowed up by the mist. This is the, the origin of one of Mount Hikami's more recent stories of a haunted house. While the veracity of this is unclear, <clears throat> I looked into a videotape left behind by someone who stumbled across the house. Oh, hello. Uh, the video is apparently famous in occult circles. I contacted the publisher and received the following response. Irui Kagamiya. Kagamiya. Thank you for contacting us. The video you are, you are looking for is no longer in print, but there are some copies in our warehouse. This video prompted a huge amount of feedback from customers. The tape was found near a river on Mount Hikami. It is unknown who filmed it. There were many sections too damaged by water to be usable, and so we took what was left and edited it together. The master copy of the video was confiscated by the police. They conducted a search of the mountain, but were unable to find who shot the film or even the house's location. Now that entering the unfathomable forest is prohibited, we advise you not look into this on your own. Fujikaki Moto, Uigensha Film Division. I believe the building visible at the start of the video is the Shrine of Dolls. After that, we see, we see what seems to be a cave, but it's hard to make anything out. From the large number of books seen in the house, it's likely that it, was, that it really is the former home of Keiji Watarai. Oh. Killa? Hello? Hello? <laughs> Kazuya! Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazuya!Kazu
That's so spooky scary, dude. Spooky! The Veiled House. From the Shrine of Dolls into a cave. This may be the same route Yuri took. I should start go by going there. Let's do it. Um, do I need to grab anything? Nope, just leave the room. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Maybe I'll also find out some more about that post-mortem photograph. <sighs> probably. We'll probably find out a lot, actually. That frame rate, yo. Yeah. You're so pretty. Alright, I have 42 type 14. Um, should I switch to 7 for the moment? Yeah, let's do that. All right, yo, let's see if I can remember how to play this because it's been a weekend. Um, no ghosts yet. I'm cool with that. No! No! Sorry, don't mind me. I, I, there's sunlight coming onto my computer screen and <laughs> I think I just saw spiderweb on my fucking computer. Oh god, please don't be a spiderweb. It totally was. Oh god. There was a spider crawling all over my computer station. Oh no, what else have I touched that had spiderweb on it? I don't like spiders. Sorry. Continuing onwards. I just hit the microphone. I'm so sorry. Okay, so we gotta go to the uh, to the left. No, to the right. Oh wait, shit, wait. Is there a thing at the end of the hallway still? Let me check that. Excuse me. Hang on. Hold your horses. Nope, nothing down here. You already took it. Oh well. Oh, oh, oh. Louis, don't, don't. Uh. Oh, no, no, no. かけないで。私今死んでるんだから。お兄ちゃん。お兄ちゃんはお姉ちゃん。私は嘘つき。お、私は。What what would have happened, I wonder, if Rui was like, yeah, I'm totally a boy. Also, why did she not, when she heard something, be like, uh, Mr. Hojo, let's, uh, there's something over here, you know? Why not communicate a little? Oh, oh, children. <laughs> what was that? Rui, where did you go? 
Uh, yeah, we gotta find Ruby. Zorn. Well, let's. Can I? Can we come in here yet? Or oh, it is. It's it's open. There are stairs leading underground below the doll display. I might be able to reach this womb cabin through here. But first, I have to find Ruby. Okay, cool. What I figured. More hide and seek, but this time with Rui. <sighs> okay. Now the spookiness really begins. Oh, do I want to go down there? What? Not really. It kind of sounds bad down there. Is there someone? <laughs> I hate this. You know, I'm just going to go this way instead first. Because fuck that underground area. I hate it. I hate it down there. There's the floaty ghosts and they're terrifying. We're going to explore this way first. The atmosphere in this game is like so spooky and unsettling. And I love it, but I hate it. What? Hello? Oh. 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 Someone fell. <gasps> ah! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I was I scratched my head. I wasn't ready. <laughs> that was scary. I literally just itched my head the moment that the little guy jumped at me. <laughs> that was spooky. Okay, um, should we open this one? Yeah, there might be someone in here. Right, because this was- wasn't this spooky closet? Is it not spooky closet? I thought this was the spooky closet. Hello? I don't trust anyone or anything. These dolls are so spooky. Oh, gosh. All right, you know what? You are. You are indeed. All right. Can I... <sighs> they won't let you take another picture of them, though. Oh, fuck! Haha! <laughs> <laughs> I got that one, kinda. All right. So not you, which is fine. What about... What, what, what's through here? More hallway. More hide-and-seek. We're seeking and hiding. Oh, we're doll. Hey, doll. Okay. Not hearing any whispers there, but what about here? Is this just outside? No, that's not outside, but that is a thing. Another closet and another hidden ghost. Where? Oh, I'm literally directly on top of you, and that is an issue. Oh, Rui. Rui. Thank God. Ren, why is your arm doing that? Why is your wrist doing that? Rui seems to be okay. I have to find the way to the Veiled House. Yuri said there is an entrance to a cave below the doll display in the front shrine. Yep. Let's -a go. I'm just gonna go back the Whoa, way I came. Okay, bye. I don't want to play right now, guys, okay? I'm playing a different game <laughs> where I'm hunting ghosts. You guys should join me in some of that. What? Hi! Oh, fuck! No! I missed them! Shit! Oh, well. Too late. Oh, 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 you! Oh, you! Oh, you! Okay, bam. Ba bam, ba bam. Shink! This guy's scary. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Dewey! 
escape. What? All right, where are you going, bro? Where are you going? What's happening, huh? 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 What's up? What's what? No. Oh, 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 oh fuck! <laughs> it's so spooky, scary. Can I fucking get up, please? Thank you. All right, Louie, hang on. Ha! Ah! Get off, my lady! Up. Oh god! Okay. What is your health like? Oh, it's pretty. It's pretty not, not bad, not good, but not bad. Do you okay? Oh shit! That guy's after you. Let me just do that one, and then maybe. Can I? Can I touch you? Or are you on the other side? Oh shit! Fuck! No! Wait! Come back! Let me touch you. <laughs> Through the wall. Touching a wall. I wish they gave subtitles for that section. I have no idea what he's saying. Something about the black water, I think. The black water overflowing. Check it? Ch -ch 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 check it out. I can see water through a hole in the passage floor. Some of the dolls are missing from the shelf. They must have been washed away. Mayhaps. Mayhaps they have. All right, let's get back to the shrine area. Shrine of dolls. The room, the room of shrine of dolls. Oh, look who it is. She's like, you're a man though. <laughs> Yeah, that was kind of weird, huh? What token, I wonder, is she talking about? I legit do not remember. <laughs> Alright, let's go in the creepy, floaty ghost space. Waiting? Little ominous girl. <laughs> Shit, I forgot about ghost hands. I think Rui is still a little under the influence of ghosts. Under the ghost influence. The ghost fluence. 
<clears throat> okay, please no ghosts. No ghosts, please, please. I don't want any. I don't want any in here, please. Don't do it. Please, I know I have to fight them. Fuck. Camera Obscura is reacting. Boop. Ooh. Yeah, that's gonna... That's gonna... That's gonna not be good. Do I have to open it myself, or do I just gotta take the photo of it? Like... Uh, it's a finely decorated wooden box. The lid is shut and I can't get it open. Well, that's the box in question, I think. Hi. Do I... Is it wrong? It doesn't seem like it's wrong. It's gotta be that one, right? Hmm. Maybe it was this one. I don't think it was this one, but maybe it is. Mm -hmm. Can't get it open. What? <laughs> I mean, you gotta recreate the photo, right? Could have sworn it was this one. Let's take a look, shall we? Yeah. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. I, th I think... I think you have to move. <laughs> do I have to crouch? Is crouching a thing I can do? Excuse me, do we? Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. No! Ah! <laughs> oh, God. No, no, no. No, no, no. Ah! <laughs> oh, God. Can you- can you guess who that is? Can you see their outfit? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Can you guys see who that is? <laughs> Freaking Dewey in there. So funny. Are you done? Are you done? You got more! You got more in you! Oh god! Um... That is... Haruka! Can I touch you? Nope. I don't know what you said. Sorry, I don't know what you said. That was... that was Haruka. She's dead. Sorry. So, Fuyuhi and Haruka are now ghosts. The ghost dropped something when it disappeared. Looks like an old metal plate key. I'm kind of sad that you can't, like, touch her spirit, though. At least yet. I don't know if you can in the future, but, like, I'm kind of sad that you can't touch her and see, like, exactly how she died. You know? Heavy lattice door is locked. An iris flower is engraved on the lock. You inserted the iris plate key into the lock. I mean, obviously, we know Fuyuhi... Like, lured her there, you know? But... Yeah. Alright, it's the Veiled House. Is there someone there? I didn't see anyone. 61! I might need that later. Anything over here? Nope. All right, let's go in the Veiled House. It's a spooky, spooky place. This is probably another one of my least favorite uh, places in the game. Hey, is that a healing water? Can I have that? Can I have it? I see it. Can I have it? Like, it's right there. Give me the water of healing. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. It was- ah, oh, there it is. It's like, it was so close. Cool. Got a sacred water. Alright, um... Oh god, a siren just went off outside on the street and it scared the poop out of me for a second.
I don't trust this place. I don't like this place. This place is a bad place to be. This is a bad place to be. Woo, got two herbal medicine. Oh, fuck! Such beauty. Let's switch back to seven for a second. Uh, turn around. Okay. What am I checking? There's a wooden box on top of low chest of drawers. The hinges had rusted over. It will not open. Ah, oh, how unfortunate. Look, and the TV's on. How is that possible? The old television is switched on. The screen is blurred with static. I can't make anything out. Why is it even on? You know what I'm saying? Like, if I was in... If I walked into an abandoned house... Being held shut. Okay, if I walked into an abandoned house... And I saw that a TV was on, and this place is abandoned, and there shouldn't maybe be power even though the lights are on, which is also kind of weird. Um, I don't know, man. I'd probably be like, what the fuck? You know? What? Shit! Oh, God! <laughs> Hi. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let me. Please let me. Oh god, oh god. Oh god. I got him, but I didn't, apparently. Oh god. I'm, like, so cornered. Dewey! Hi! Bam. Just take your picture for funsies. I do like having Dewey with me because then she's kind of like bait. Alright, alright, alright. Get, 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 get. Let me touch you. Touchy touch. Touchy spirit. Touch! <laughs> Yes! Yes! Alright, where was I? Oh, I was looking at this area. Oh, fuck that shit. Fuck that shit. Nope, I don't want to. I don't want to. Can I not? I'm just gonna read this first, okay? Sorry about the ringing in the back, but, you know. There is an old notebook lying on the shelf. It's written in very elegant handwriting. There's a peculiar custom in this country. It varies from region to region, but the root is the same. It is a mystery, yet somehow beautiful. In order to understand it, I traveled across the country before settling on this mountain. The beauty of the morning dew, the palpable heartbreak of the sun setting behind the mountain, and the grave and solemn night that envelops it. On the mountain, water itself is revered, but why? To try and understand this, I have made this mountain my hum. It's my hum. Anything in here? Ooh, type 90 film? Hell yeah! All right, yo, what do you want, ghost of my friend? He's dead. It's exactly the same as the picture from the photo album. Did Kazuya come here because of it too? And why are there so many copies? Ghost marriage. Alrighty then. Um, we couldn't go through here, right? Yeah. Hmm, isn't anyone inside? But what if there was? Dun dun dun! So obviously, what? I'm sorry, what? What? What is here? Is it on this other side, maybe? Oh, yes it is. I was gonna say, obviously we're gonna follow the dude. Hi, lady! Ah! Oh god, I tried. I tried so hard and got so far, but in the end, it doesn't really matter. It's sort of like she said, woohoo! <laughs> that was funny. Where you at? Oh, Jesus. I thought she brought friends for a second. It's just her little self-portraits circling around her. 
All right, fantastic. You're done. You're done, son. Give me a... Give, no, fuck, shit. No, stop it. I want to touch. Let me touch. I can't touch her. <laughs> fuck. Ugh, God. That's the kind of BS that I'm talking about where I'm like, let me touch, please. But it's like, nope. No touchy. It is just like the video. There was a dude in here. He's right there. He was like, hi guys. I'm right here. A hyuk? Sweet! Up, 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 up! Keiji Watarai. Watarai. I don't know why I have such a hard time saying his name. My brain is like, Waitari! And I'm like, no. Watarai. Hello? No one's in there. Ugh. 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 Am I stuck in a corner? I'm trying to get out of it, and it was like, no. Well... See, this house is, is, is frustrating to fight in because of all the tiny spaces, also. The lock is broken. I can't open the door. I don't know. Who is narrating right now? Can I go in now? Damn. Well, fine. Okay, fine. I guess we'll... Uh, go back down. Very slowly, because I'm cautious. Um, can I leave? Fuck. What else am I to do then? Hmm. Can I? Damn it. Fuck. That way, okay. Oh, there's a door here. I'm an idiot. <laughs> of course there's a door. <laughs> Run away! Run away! <laughs> Scaring the poop out of me, man. All right, where is, where is that ghost? Sorry, he just gave me... Oh, you're right there. Oh, fuck, shit. Can you even get me? No, you're stuck on a balcony. You dumb- <laughs> Oh god. Uh, Nui! Nui! <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. That was really funny, though. Let me touch you. I'm gonna touch you? I'll touch you, it'll make you feel better. <laughs> I like how I was like, haha, you're stuck on a rail. Just kidding. <laughs> you, you jumped on me. Okay. Purifying embers. Fantastic. Look at all these people on the walls. Beautiful. Wonderful. You're gorgeous. All of you. Sacred water. I'm getting really lucky with all of this stuff. Look at that rad shrine over there. Cool, 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 cool. Open. Door is being shut. Well, fine then, I guess. Ooh, there's a up. Oh, oh, the photo is calling to me. He looked like he did a little skip right there. Yes, good. I needed more fourteen. Photo is smiling at him. Oh, what a happy photo. No ghost hand. Don't do it. Oh, thank God. Postmortem photography made its way over from the west along with the spread of the camera. When photography was still rare, images of the deceased helped the surviving family members deal with their grief. The postmortem photographs that still exist in Japan use the same methodology as their western counterparts, but the significance seems to differ. Seem to differ. Those taken here in Mount Hikami region especially seem to embody a certain melancholic beauty. I believe these photos were the work of a scientist named Kunihiko Aso, which, if you know anything about Fatal Frame, should be a familiar name. 
pretty sure Asso created the camera obscura. Uh, having researched photos from other areas as well, I'm pretty sure it's him, right? There's so many people in, in this whole series. It seems he was the one behind many of them. His surviving records indicate a determination to use photography to capture the soul. Yeah, he created the camera obscura. Seeing these strange and captivating photographs, I've come to believe he had some degree of success in doing so. He had a lot of success in doing so, and also the spirit radio. An old friend of mine used to call cameras lonely boxes. I'm not sure if he meant that the subject appears trapped alone in this dark box when viewed through a viewfinder, or that looking through the viewfinder meant peering out through the dark all alone. At any rate, I find those words have a certain resonance. It's because it captures the spirit. It's the spirit capturer! That picture! What picture? Where are you? I don't see him anywhere. He's just talking. I must go. Wow, he like really digs her, huh? The waters of this mountain are beautiful. A large volume of water flows from a lake at, a, at the summit, becoming rivers and waterfalls and enveloping the mountain in mist. Water covers everything. It's the source of this mountain's beauty as well as its sense of mystery. According to local tradition, Mount Hikami is where one could die a proper death. It has long been considered a spiritual spot and the subject of much worship, taking it, I'm sorry, making it a righteous destination for, the, for those seeking death. The Mount Hikami sect taught that upon dying, people return to water. Here on the mountain, water is considered the source of the soul. A person's soul is then said to have, to, sorry, to return to water upon death rather than moving on to an afterlife. Those ready for death would gather at, a, at the mountain and return their lives to the water. Water connects everything. To look at this scenery and understand how it has become a spiritual place, a place fit for passing from this world. I'm glad I came here. The people on this mountain have a yearning for death. That is to say they have a yearning for water and a yearning for nature. Life and death are both connected to water. Cassette. All right. Um. Is it here? No, oh, wait, fuck, hang on. Okay, here's the, uh, here's the thing. Weird thought, but does that mean that when they drink water, they're drinking death? It's curious. What? Lost in thought. It's me, constantly. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go this way first, just because I... Maybe not, that's actually just a door. Never mind, there's nothing there. I'm gonna look at, uh, this stuff over here for a second. What's this? What are you? What are those? Folklore notes too. I saw the silhouette of a shrine maiden, uh, from within the mist that envelops the mountain. With great care, she made her way slowly up the mountain. Something about her seems somehow unnatural. I've been told there are no more shrine maidens on the mountain now. Long ago, many maidens were murdered, murdered here. Perhaps they returned to the water? Would that then imply they are trapped within the mist? <gasps> Maybe. They do like that mist. They do be liking the mist.
It is said that human sacrifice was once practiced throughout this region. Rather than returning people to the water upon death, the ritual involved placing so-called pillars in special relique reliquaries and sending them to the water while still alive. I just remembered something about Fatal Frame 4. So, this reachy grabby thing, because I was like, boy, I'm sure glad that uh, if, you, if one of the ghost hands grabs you, it doesn't completely get rid of that item like it does in 4. And then I was like, wait, is that what happens in 4? Yeah. So when you try to reach for things in 4 and the ghost hand grabs you, it means that item that you're trying to grab disappears. And I really hope that's something that they change when they re-release the fourth one. I hope they make it more like this one because it's so harsh. <laughs> okay. It is said that human... Wait, I already read that. Yep, while well, still alive. Cool. It was the role of Shrine Maidens to become such pillars. They would take on the memories of the dying and thereafter return to water themselves. In doing so, it was believed the subjects would continue living on as pillars. In Japan, there was once a sect of Buddhist monks who, were, who would enter themselves in boxes buried underground for the sake of enlightenment. These monks were said to show they were still alive by ringing bells and chanting. This practice may be, may be related. But what did the maidens who became pillars fear or hope to appease? There are various teachings in Japan about where the afterlife, also known as the netherworld or the hereafter, is located. Some teachings say it is above the mountains or across the sea, where others claim it lies underground within the very earth itself. Here on the mountain, it is said to lie within the water, implying a close link between water and death. The pillars within the reliquaries would be in a place close to death, but would go on living. Perhaps it was the, spe the special reliquaries that allowed them to evade death and continue living, frozen in time. It is thought that perpetuating these pillars allowed those uh, close to death to live longer lives. In a sense, it was believed that proximity to death helped develop a resistance to it. Ooh. Yo, what up? Alright, cool. <laughs> Let's listen to the first one. Ray? I mean, Ray. Do we? You're not Ray. Ray's from the third game. I'm hearing a ghost or something. Wait, did I? I think I went. I'm going backwards. I always do that. I always get so turned around in here. All right, do we? Let's try this door. Door is locked. What about this one? Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. I'm hearing talking, yo. Who be all up in my space? All up in my face in space. My spacey face. Uh, yes. Can I take that? Can I have it? I see it. Can I have it? Me once. 14. Very nice, very nice. Alright, we're going up to the spooky place. Ladder leads up to the attic, just like in the last part of the video. Uh, I hate this. Uh, they do this so freaking well, but it's so spooky, scary, creepy. Oh my god, the slow turn and everything. I mean, he's not there, right there. But what if he's on the other part? Why wouldn't you look quickly? Oh, shit! Oh, my God. Hello, goodbye. What the? The ghost left a notebook behind when it disappeared. This looks like the notebooks... The notebook of the folklorist. Could that ghost just now have been... Yep. Mount Hikami seemed to have... Seems to have been both revered and feared as a mountain of death, where only those prepared to die may enter, and those who visited were never allowed to leave. Visitors of the mountain had to pass through the shrine grove at the foot of the mountain, where the shrine maidens kept strict watch in allowing only the qualified, that is, the dying, to enter. 
Today, the shrine at this grove has been rebuilt as an inn, whose innkeeper kindly let me borrow records of the time period. <sighs> so he's just letting everyone in. The records from the shrine's final year list one individual who was able to leave the mountain alive. Kuniho Kunihiko Aso. After taking the, his postmortem photographs, it seems he was invited to the mountain to photograph the maidens. I've heard his research into the hereafter allowed him to develop a special camera. Yep. If I could see these photos of the Shrine Maidens taken with the special camera, I'm certain I could come closer to unraveling the mysteries of Mount Hikami. When invited to the mountain, it is said he allowed he was allowed into a house visited only by a select few individuals. If I were invited to the mountain, would I be able to reach this place too? I truly wish I could. Kunihiko Aso, was Dr. Aso somehow involved in this? There's a lot of mist in here. Mist is pouring into the room. That's not a good sign I should get out of here. Yeah, mist means, also where the fuck is Rui again? Um, do I have the film that I want? I'm gonna switch to 61. Where the heck is Rui? Um, yeah, mist means the Shrine Maidens are coming, because that they like to- they like to hang out in the mist, you know? And I swear to god, if this is the part that I think it is, I'm- I'm gonna die. <laughs> like me, actual me, not Ren. Ugh. So much tension right- Door's being shut! Fuck! Shit! Do I have to- Do I have to- Oh, shit! No! God damn it! Alright. I think that one's Kazuya. Woohoo! Oh boy! Excuse me, pardon me. Uh, where the heck is he? Oh, he's right there. Hi. Hello. Kazuya? Where the fuck are you? Oh, you're right there now. Come at me, bro. Come at- come at her. Look at how strong he is. I'm using 61. Like, Jesus. Like, Jesus, bro. I'm just gonna use my my epic flash. All right, you're almost done. I'm almost done with you. Look at your little wiggly wobbly walk. My goodness, just just get over! Oh god. Okay, cool. Um, can I touch you? Let me touch you. Want to touch? Give me the touch. Give me the touch. <laughs> I'm like right on top of him. Or is this? Is this Watarai? He looks so different. I thought that was Kazuya for a second. There's definitely ghosty goos. Oh, look at her. Oh. Okay, she got spooky scary again. There's an outline where that ghost was. On the way to the summit, I found a photo on a small path lined with spider lilies. I thought for a second it just said spiders, and I was like, ew. The path seemed to head into the forest, but it has become overgrown and is unpassable. Could it lead to that mansion? that only the invited can find. It is different from other post-mortem photographs. They can only describe it as being beautiful. Or sorry, I can only describe it as being beautiful. <clears throat> it had a beauty and a sadness unlike the others I've seen. Was she alive? As soon as I thought how beautiful she was, I was bound. I heard whispers of love from the photograph. 
They were the words of a curse. Love after death, I must go to that place. My heart has been captivated. There's a cassette tape. Was that one of Keiji Watarai's memories? I have to get out of here. Yeah, we'll get out of here in a second. Just, uh, we're just gonna listen to one more fun little thing, okay. Damn, yo. I'm just gonna keep my 61 film on me. Um, you know, just cuz. Just cuz. You never know who else you might run into in this spooky, spooky veiled house. Do I still? How? What? Do, wait, do I need to. Do we, what are you doing in there? No, it's not one of those. Well, what the shit? Do I need to go out this other way? I thought defeating him would help with that, but maybe I have to go back out this way. Is this a way to go? Oh, oh, is this maybe the actual way to go? No, this is definitely not. Oh God, oh God, no, 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 ah! Oh fuck, oh God. Oh my God. God, he's scary. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh, he's walking right, pa right past her. He's like, fuck that girl. I don't even care. Oh, God. Oh, shit. Okay, it's fine. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. I would like to do... Oh, fuck. No, no. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. No, no, no. You know what? You know what? You know what? You know what? No, oh, shit, 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 shit. Fuck, 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 fuck. Get out of here. Get out. Oh, fuck! Oh, I almost had him. Dewey, you were in my way. Oh, God. Jesus. What in the world is happening? Camera, stop it. What is happening right now? I am not even moving my body, and he is moving. This is glitchy as fuck. <laughs> okay, you know what? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Are you above us? What the fuck? Oh, you're right here now. Okay, cool. Hi. I'm just gonna take one little photo of you. Oh god! It's always at the wrong time, I swear. Oh god! Oh god! I thought I got you. I pressed the button and everything. You didn't get me though, did he? Unless that- unless my health is- no, my health's not very low. That's crazy. Alright, alright, alright bro. Alright bro, come at me! Come at me, do it! Yeah! Oh, come on! I totally pressed it! You son of a bitch! Fuck that. Show yourself, you, you dude. You dude! He's got such a small frame of like... Of like... Time to hit him. Just gonna take out your flame. Fuck that flame. Such a tiny time space. Oh, 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 there he goes, there he goes. Okay, bye. What the? I know, right? He's so angry. Well, he knocked down one of these things. What? Where, where did we come from, Rui? Was it here? 
I mean, kind of, yeah. I wonder if there's anything else here, real quick, before we leave. Okay, I'm also gonna switch back to 14 now, maybe? Hello? Tall lady? <gasps> tall lady! Oh my god, tall woman. Oh, tall lady is scary. Many spooks, many scares. Okay, let's go out this door, maybe? Whew. Yeah, tall woman is fucking scary, man. Actually, I might want to stick with this for the moment. Let's just, let's just run. We're just gonna run. We're just gonna run. Oh, fuck. Yep, that's what I expected. That, that lady there, she's exactly what I expected. Oh, 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 oh God. Can I just run? <laughs> will, I, will, I, will she let me out? Oh, thank God. I didn't have to fight her. Oh, I mean, fighting her would have been good for points, but like, yeah. That lady, that reliquary lady, she freaks me the fuck out. It was another floaty ghost. Whew. Bye bye, Veld House. How interesting, right? Isn't that fucking crazy? It just disappears, like, right in front of them? That's insane! Although I imagine that's also what, like, the... the village in 2 does. Because it's, like, lost, right? It's just lost somewhere in the forest. And then one day it just appears. Okay. So. <sighs> Sorry, I was stretching. <clears throat> Bamboo! shiny. Not that I necessarily need it, but I'll take it. <laughs> Hojo don't like that. Say, don't talk about my friend like that. Might as well use the cable car. Oh, fine. Okay. Let's go up on the cable car. Ugh. How do I get up there? Louie! Louie, help me! <laughs> um, is it back this way? Is that where, like, the little stairs are? Yep. Okay. I just completely missed it! Um... I'm, I'm scared of tall woman, okay? That's what I'm scared of. Cool, cool. What if tall- what if I stood up after picking that up and tall woman was like face to face with me because she's so freaking tall? Ugh. Tall lady is the spookiest. Ren and Rui set out to find the folklorist's house relying on clues from a video recording. As they passed through the shrine of dolls, the white haired girl from Ren's dream appeared. She asked why he didn't bring her token and then vanished. Ren and Rui arrived in the Veiled House, where they discovered several of Keiji Watarai's writings on the customs and beliefs surrounding Mount Hinkami. They escaped the house only to see it vanish in a thick veil of mist. I got an A! Ooh, ooh! What, what? Cool. Is there gonna be another interlude? No, there's not. We're going straight into the sixth drop. We gotta find Miu. Ooh, we're playing as Yuri. Okay, cool. So we're gonna go ahead and do that next time. Um, thank you guys so much for joining me. So sorry that I am having so many difficulties with my camera right now. I'm really trying to troubleshoot it, but this camera is good, but it also sucks. It's new, so it's freaking out a lot, um, but the quality is great. So. I still have a lot of troubleshooting to do with that. Um, hopefully you guys are enjoying the video even without my face being plastered on it. Um, but yeah, I will see you in the next one. Bye!